Hello YouTube, my name is Abam and now I will show you about my software ASPHP Editor You can download in my website asastudio.org and go to product and you find Asa Studio software here just go to googledrive.com this is about my software and go to here as php editor version 1.14.9 okay just click this and download the software and i will continue to install after you download, go to your folder and double click ASPHP editor version 1.14.9 setup and just follow the installation process. Double click this software, this file and choose your language here and I choose English and press OK and here press next and you must accept the listen okay like this this is my word in Indonesian and press next and you can choose the folder what you want and here I choose like this and press ok and next and next and I check create a desktop icon and next and install ok now if I finish the installation I can launch as PHP editor just click finish Okay, this is preview as PHP editor and I will continue about how to use this software. Okay, you have as PHP editor now and first you must go to localhost here. Click localhost and go to localhost setting and here I have a setting and you must type anything in localhost setting and anything in database setting if you use WAM you must add a localhost and here localhost 2 and here C like this WAM and www just like this if you use WAM in your computer but if you use ZAM X A M P P you must type like this ah uh, sorry X ZAM P P and here you must type ht docs maybe like this and here you must add a project if you use WAM you must add a project to www but if you use xampp you must add a project to HT doc okay like this and now in database setting you must type uh, your username in WAM installation process if you add a username type here and password here and in database name you must add a name of 
databases. Okay, maybe like this about database setting. And here I have a jQuery. If you use jQuery function, just check it like this. Okay, and after you have setting, you can click save. But in this case, in my computer, I need AS and here I need D and as a side in my local host I must add like this and here AS one 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 okay this is about my computer if you type anything about your local host and your database okay maybe like this go to save setting and click the button okay now i have a local host setting okay after you add all information in local host and database you can save setting okay after that i go to project create a project and here maybe uh, sphp toots okay maybe like this uh, maybe like this and here about and maybe like this and create a new project and now if i save a project and refresh i have a blank but if i add something like this just control s and control space you have as a studio like this okay now if you add a database you must type php code like this php and here i just include or require i use include once and opening and closing and you must type the name of connection file i add a name connexi like this dot php okay now you have a connection just control s and control space you have a blank okay and now i just try to load table maybe like this and i try to add variable again and here i need maybe news and equal mysql query and opening and closing like this and here select all from i have a table name brita i add this ah sorry and i add here okay now i need a new variable and maybe gp news and equal mysql fetch a sort maybe like this and just type a uh, first variable dollar news okay after that i just echo the output by type dollar uh, gp news and side like this double quote and closing function and here i have to do okay if i add like this just go to project save and refresh i have a title here this is judul in indonesian title okay i have a title 
and if you want to load all data from tabel you just add while okay like this and this is closing and opening and here closing just like this now if i go to project save or ctrl plus s and project refresh ctrl space you have all title here and you can add a format maybe like this ctrls ctrl space i have all title from tabel berita berita in indonesian news in indonesian berita okay like this and if you have a setting okay if you check in jquery you can use jquery function maybe like this i add maybe a class div class and equal test maybe and i closing the div okay like this and here i need class and maybe new class okay maybe like this new class and here background background maybe red and padding maybe 20 pixel and maybe border one pixel solid and maybe yellow okay maybe like this and okay i add a four pixel okay this is a new class and in javascript i add jquery function maybe uh, like this dollar opening and closing and here i add a class test and dot add class and opening and closing okay and here i add new class okay maybe like this and if you go to project save and refresh oh sorry okay here i need dot to add a html code okay just like this go to project save and refresh i have all a class have a class design okay just like this if you add a database in uh, local host setting and database setting and if you want to use jquery just check okay maybe this is about preview about as php editor i hope you like about this software because this software can help you to more understanding about uh, php html CSS, JavaScript, and jQuery. Okay, maybe in next time I will show you about anything, maybe Game Maker, Java, or anything. Okay, thank you for watching. Goodbye.